I just wanted to thank video games for getting me through some of the toughest times of my life. And to Tears of the Kingdom for making me delay the production of this EP. I can honestly say that it makes gaming more exciting than it's ever been. Ever. That's all I'm saying. That's it. Jake Line out here telling me I'll see. Is that a threat? I can't tell. I have concerns. But I'm, I'm running down today. I'm uh, abducted and abduction. Okay. I'm just running down the community, seeing what's got some high plays on it. Picking from there. National passing parade? Sure. Why not? A better popping farm? Let's do it. You're saying nothing? All right. Let's see here. Let's get our Marble Centauri. Siege. What else? So uh, let's see here. Long lovely air, dazzling master's dream. So, uh, oh, nuclear. All right, we'll do. We'll, we'll pull nuclear. Radiant Parallel Parrot. Oh, we did Radiant Parallel Balance. Sporty Bouncy Bombardment. I guess that'll be it. Alright, and then we will pick our final. Let's do another slide. 16 races are selected. I won't start the countdown timer quite yet. We'll give that a moment or two. 
before we do that. In the meantime, I'm gonna make, make the obligatory reminder. Join the event. Exclamation point play. Get in there on that. The Nasco's already in. Geodad did not need a personal invite for today. Excellent. Funk is in. And Nasco, we've got we've got a trinity of Nascos here today. Let's go. Let's go. And uh I'll probably give it one more minute and then I'll punch it so we can get rolling at 1203. And we'll be all set. Mini games out there. Bowers in. Good day, Bower. Oh wow! Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Everybody drinking in. Look, look at that. Look at that 673 there. Wow! We're in the presence of greatness, everybody. That's in the world of all of marbles. Machete Man, welcome. Gonna remind everybody the countdown timer has started. Make sure you have RSVP to the event. Make my life easier for distributing XP. Let's make this happen. As we get ready, less than 30 seconds, Smeagol. Diving across the finish line here. 20 seconds remaining, give or take. Exclamation point play. As we get ready for our traditional start at Alienated. Uh, Geodad, all that matters is you have your XP. And you're not here to try to take the win from anybody else. Buster, uh, I tried to... I don't know if Buster made it or not. It still shows me time when Buster's Buster dropped his marble in there. It's like they cut it off actually at three seconds. Weak. Gen 3 and Cranky Witch on one side, GTP on the other. Oh no. Okay, yeah, we're safe over there. <clears throat> Everybody's safe so far. Funk on the move. I feel like these aliens have gotten a lot less aggressive. Really phoning it in. Look at this, they're just way behind. Really slacking. Uh-oh. See here, who? No. Bauer getting a late grab, so he's going to survive. Uh oh, Jen Nasco, though. Jen Nasco definitely is in there. Nobody else has gotten it yet. Jen Nasco might be getting the first eliminated today. There it is. She's gone. Jen Nasco first eliminated. Rest in peace, Jen. Jen, in the book. Ready to go. First eliminated. Get that bonus. Be Jen Nasco day soon. Oh, God. Here we go. Uh-oh. Funk and Darth both okay. Ooh, they look like they were in trouble. Oh, no. Here we go. Go back, go back, go back. Come on, no, not that fast, not that fast. Go back again. No. Now, technically, the physics should be when it moves that way. The marble should roll off the side. In. Cranky witch might get it. Nope, she whiffs. Oh, Smeagol will land it though. Smeagol. Geo dad, only in for one race, but gets second place. GTP machete man. Look at that trio all together. Alden, I think, might have been abducted. DW whiffs. Bauer's going to be in. Let's see what happens to our last two marbles here. This might be a big finisher. That's a that's a 10 marble finisher. 
Spiegel gets 59 points to kick it off. Exclamation point play. Marbles on the move. Darth Mashes an accelerating adventure nest. Not one we've played. I've tried to pick some ones we have not played from the community playlist before. So let's try it. Exclamation point play. Where's where's Buster? Where's Buster the one? Was the last second trying to get in last race? Ariel Apostle, are you in? Buster Boy's in, okay. Ariel. Ariel. I thought I saw. There's Alden. You're right there, Alden. You're good. All right. Are you ready? It's the marbles. Power and Jen Nasco leading the way. Pretty safe up there. Oh, Alden picking up some speed, though. Power and Jen Nasco just slingshotting back and forth. Little shake and bake. They battle it out with one another. We got a little divot up here. This isn't good. Oh, boy. I gotta see, stay here and see what happens. Does everybody get by? All right, everybody made it. Everybody made it. Little little random holes in the side of the course there. Get back to power and Jen Nasco leading the way. Here comes the laser field. Look at Jen swerving around. Jen Masco. Oh, there go the bodies burning up. Mine, of course, there. Six marbles gone. Not for Jen with a little bit of a lead now. Exclamation point play better. It's my marble. Oh no, that's it. Jen Nasco down. Bauer out. Oh god, Jay Klein. 673 in the world, but not gonna finish this race. ODB misses. Jube. I mean to try and take over. There goes Jube. On the move, followed by Darth Smeagol. Smeagol feeling himself today. Shetty man got zapped. Laser beams. On the move. Oh no, now he's getting stuck in the swirl. No, he, he made it. He made it. Okay. This looks like a pretty generous pin drop here. Not one of those ones at the bottom where suddenly you can go too far to the side and you get eliminated. Oh wow, Jube. Crushing those rocks, giving Buster Boy the opportunity to take over here. And Buster. Buster's going to take it. Buster snags the win. Jube snagging defeat from the jaws of victory, but gets in ahead of Darth Smeagol, who will lock up third, followed by Alden and Cranky Witch. Ooh, boy. I thought Cranky Witch might have been in trouble there. Let's take a look at our, our points here. Jay Klein, look at that. Look at that for Jay Klein. Grand Pete Pre Smeagol is way in front here. As we head to race number three, Buster enjoying the win moves him up to second place. Pristine, Rainbow Road, exclamation point play. As we get ready for a little bit of Mario Kart action.
Oh, Jay Klein, I think, lost the position. We've been costing Jay Klein his spot again. I had concerns we scared him away yesterday. 30 seconds left. Exclamation point play. Bauer has made sure that has happened. Oh, there's Bauer. Okay, I was going to say, where did Bauer go, though? Buried behind grumpy trash player. Reminder, here's the event code. Make sure you've RSVP'd and you are in. Make my point distributing life easier. Everyone is on the way. Dennis, though, jumps on the boost pad and ends up slamming into the wall because of it. Cluster of marbles all together here, traveling as a pack. Oh, and they don't even split up as they go to, they all go to one side. Whoa, which is for the best because it looks like that other side planned to just murder everybody? I believe it did. Well, speaking of murdering everybody, oh, you gotta be kidding me. There's just splits happening here with the marbles as Jube gets laser beamed. Funk somehow pulling ahead up front here. Whatever's happening here, getting getting Funk stopped up here. Here we go. Funk coming around. Coming around he goes. Oh my goodness, a whole bunch of marbles stuck up top there. Cranky Witch chasing Funk down right now. The wall is causing troubles though. Fitz there. Oh, oh, Darkwing Dad took over. I was going to say, where did Funk end up at there? GTP goes cleanly through that funnel, though. Sopped up at the wall. Into the tumbler, they both go. Out of the tumbler here. Hate being in that thing. Let's see what happens here as GTP is cleared along with Alden. J. Klein whiffs. Oh, God, he's going to be really mad about his ranking now. Another tumbler coming up. TP and Alden drop into the next tumbler here. GTP clears it as does Alden. Oh boy, Funk went right through though. All together now as they approach the wall. Funk. First to clear it. GTP gets a little boost there. Oh my goodness. JTP gets a big boost. Bypasses the turn. So does Alden. Alden and GTP both bypassing. Both bypassing the spin. Look, Funk is still in there. Grumpy Trash Player and Alden both on their way. Alden coming around the bend. And barring disaster. Yep, Alden has got it. GTP is finished. Channel 3 Marble also finished, but not in the good way. Bauer also just plop. Cranky Witch. Cranky Witch's scores are going to be dangerous because she's always right there. Funk. Look at that. Funk gets crushed while the others all bypass the spin here. I don't have a good feeling. Dennis and Machete Man at least. Because the blaze of glory is coming from Jen Nasco makes it through. Trying to make something happen here, Machete Man. Machete Man might make it. Dennis, I don't think will. Come on, Machete Man, get down there. Move, 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 move. Can he do it? He did it. Machete Man made it. Dennis did not. Machete Man locks up fifth place but falls short on points. Grand Prix now puts Alden in front as uh, Darth Smeagol sleep at the wheel on that one. Thought he could take a race off. Dark obscured flame GTP watching his daughter die in every every map that has been raced thus far exclamation point play everybody's got 50 seconds left 
get in here and watch Jen Nasco die in a fourth race. Will she run the table in eliminations today? Maybe. The Smeagol's in this one. Back at the wheel. Just over 20 seconds left. Exclamation point play. Get your marbles in here. In the meantime, play some Smash Brothers. Get ready for Saturday. Six seconds remain. Five, four, three, two... All the marbles just kind of cluster together here. Getting ready for a big drop, it looks like. Here we go. Whee! A little, uh, little mini funnel here. There's a lot of speed going around yet, so I was afraid of Buster Boy and Bauer moving very much in the wrong direction here. And Nasco not eliminated yet. Always right there. Channel 3 Marble jumps in front of her. Followed by Nasco. So jumps in front of her and followed by her, obviously. Darkwing Dad trying to, to ram her into the wall there. Just give her a little nudge. Oh boy, here we go. Into our next drop in the funnel here. Right, nobody's dead sure if those were lasers or something else. GTP on the move through the outside. GTP still in second place. Jake Klein moving along. Oh, these marbles are dropping straight down into that funnel. Into the tumbler. Get their way out of here first. And does J.E. Nasco. Still, still moving. GTP says, nah, dad's going to take over here. Oh, Jube sneaks in front of him, though. Let's go. Jube and GTP clearing the one side. Jen Nasco trying to catch up to dad on the other. Trying to catch up to Jube. They've got walls. Walls will be the great equalizer. My marbles did too. Fear not. Whoa, 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 whoa. How'd she do that? How'd she do that? I missed that. What happened there? Smeagol, you're up in the tumbler up there still, bud. And Nasco somehow jumps ahead of everybody. Locking in a big win. Jube, second place. Machete Man. Funk. GTP. GTP was looking like they're going, they were going to win. And then comes the daughter. Says, no, thank you, Dad. I'll take that. I passed everything somehow. Wow. Smeagol, your marble's about to burn up. I'm not concerned for you. <laughs> Oops, excuse me. Jen Nasco with a big jump in there. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god, she just broke the points for the day. Jen. J.E. 
one JE Nasco. I think we could say is going to be our winner today. Wow. 182 races on this run. JE Nasco. One Jen Nasco. Sets up. Sets it up. She jumps over everybody. You know what? Not only that, I, now I need to see. Oh, where do they have? Her world placement's going to be up there. That's huge. Get ready to see. As Jen Nasco. Jen Nasco is now going to have a number next to her name ahead. Ahead of one... Jay Klein. Jen Nasco on the world leaderboard. Let's go. Let's go. Get up there. I think it's going to take a few minutes to catch up. Jay Klein dropping again, racing with us. It's like he's playing in a pro-am, getting weighed down by the uh, the amateurs here. Wow. I can't wait. Hopefully the next couple of races, we'll see an update on that. 30 seconds left to get in here. Jen Nasco may have just broken the day. That's a huge world record there. As we play a traditional marbles course. Ready. J.E. Nasco. Breaking our Grand Prix. Setting a world record by just jumping past everybody. I did not even get to see what happened. I think I ended up making a noise, blowing my nose into the microphone, unmuted. To really just sell that clip. Round and round we go. Thought we might have had somebody going in. Not quite yet. <laughs> Darth Smeagol chalking it up. Time for bed. Not coming back from that one. Top 10. So that... that According to Jay Klein, that is going to be a top 10 point getter right now. She's going to have a huge number. 10th, she will, she will probably be top 10 rank in the world right now for points after that. And that's just with those points. That's not counting the other points she's been earning. Wow. Speaking of wow not setting any records on this one because no one has cleared the funnel and we're only 40 seconds away from the world record time here so I think we're safe Good lord it took forever Dennis though leading the pack here followed by Buster Boy the pace marble from Miss Zombie Darth Smeagol not in bed yet Darth Smeagol taking over taking the alternate path from Dennis boosting again here we go big jump Darth getting ahead here. Clears it. Oh boy, we got pins firing away here. Smeagol on the move. Nice straight shot for Smeagol. Oh no, there it is. Smeagol. Blast off. Live fast, die fast. That's the uh that's the moral of the story here. So what happens to Buster Boy? Accelerating towards Towards our finish as well. Nope, jumps over. And Nasco, not happy enough with her points. She's going to lock the win up again. Jen Nasco sets a world record, gets into the top 10 for points, then goes back to back. She goes back to back. She will not be stopped. McGinley finally just making the jump. Frankie Witch trying to be the second Nasco to finish here. Oh boy. Oh boy. Machete Man, though, clearing the path. Machete Man will instead be second place here. Cranky Witch, presumably going to finish in third. Jen Nasco, dominant performance today. Truly uncatchable as GTP in a bout of frustration, watching his daughter just wreck the entire game for everybody. Anybody who got points in that race is top 20. That's how big that. McGinley going into space. Come on. 
Alden burning up, re-entering the atmosphere. Jen Nasco gets another win. 65 paltry points. Who needs 65 points? I really wish I could see the... Uh, we'll have to pull the world rankings up after this is over. We'll have broken everything. Exclamation point play. But after seeing that, listen. Um, you never know what's going to happen from there. I don't have a ranking update yet. Come on, let's go. The Marbles people are probably looking at the stream at the results uh, right now, trying to figure out what in God's green earth happened. Just over 30 seconds to get your marbles on the track. Exclamation point play. Let's do so. 30 seconds left. That was ugly. Jay Klein checking, evaluating. Jake, Jake Klein, your score, your your ranking is updated three times during the course of this race. Pixel by marbles or whatever it is, people are probably. There's an alert coming across somebody's desk. Some intern running, sweating. I th you know, I feel like it doesn't let you guys in if you're not in the last three seconds. I'm sorry. That's silly. Jake Klein wants his spot back. Oh, on the move, gets stopped. Dennis takes over. Everybody passing by Jen Nasco here again. Funk, though. On the, oops, there goes Jay Klein. He says, no, I, I want my ranking back. Nearly clearing all the pins smoothly. Let's see what he can do here. Jay Klein on the move again. Trying not to get launched into space. McGiddley takes over, followed by Alden. Frankie Witch gone, presumably launched by a pin into space. Channel 3 Marble giving a loving nudge to Jay Klein, helping him along. Alden following McIdley. Just saying clear of those pins on the side. Alden giving a little nudge to McIdley, but not, not enough to get him ahead of Alden. Just enough to let him in there. Dennis, gone. Alden nearly bumped into the air there. Alden all by himself now. Ahead of the Bulboski marble. Let's see what happens here. Someone could also get launched and get the world record here, too. This is a 171 play world record, too. That would be that would be big. But alas, no world record. Just trying to beat that Bulboski time. First bird got oh no. Oh no. Rest in peace, Alden. Jay Klein, as I mentioned, trying to get his rankings back up here. He's going to suffer. Oh, no. Dead. Jube, trying to get anything here. Jube is in. Machete Man going to follow. Both of them beating Bulboski's time for the group. C3 Marble on the way. Oh, my goodness. I thought, I thought in trouble. Funk and Bauer both taking off here and missing. Jen Nasco in. Grumpy Trash Player in. Six marbles finish. Jube, the leader of the pack here. Jube with 26,000 points himself, but nowhere near the 32,200 that Jen Nasco has. You're, McKinley, your marble, yeah, just it just stopped to talk shop back there. These are the official maps here, Darkwing. <clears throat> That's the crazy part. 32,000 points. My goodness. Get your exclamation point play in. Where is It's White Thunder? It's White Thunder, where are you? White Thunder, wake up. Get in here. Thunder Pump heard me call for Thunder. But not its White Thunder. He did not hear it. 15 seconds left. Get your marble on the track. It's White Thunder going to have some bad timing again. Six seconds left. Three... 
two, one. And away we go into the eye of the storm. All of our marbles approaching the funnel here. Let's see how the physics goes for this one. Smeagol having our record time on this one. Buster Boy now leading the pack, coming down here. Machete Man. Oh, there we go. We got records up there. Jube, 17 in the world. Wait, did Jen, where's, does Jen Asco not have it? Oh my God. Funk is 63. Machete Man, 36. Jube, 17. The talk of the Marbles world is right here, people. Jay Klein's 684. Jay Klein has dropped because... So many people have entered the top 10 in the entire world today. Jen Asco may not have enough points to qualify or something. It's White Thunder rating with Party 2. White Thunder, thank you. Thank you for rating. Just missed this one. I was trying to call I was trying to call out to you. Oh, Buster Boy, nearly a rough landing there. Let's see where all of our highly ranked players are now. Smeagol probably enraged. He's not one of them. Jen Asco gone. Bauer takes over the lead. Whoa. Nearly jumps over the wall. GTP. And of course, the Channel 3 marble. Ceased. Bauer alone, all by himself right now. Going the right direction with the wall. Should be our first place finisher. Unless somebody pulls a massive jump in here. Nope, not going to happen. Dennis's marble blasted away. Cranky Witch. I thought I thought might have had a shot there. She, she had a pretty good angle. Smeagol locking up four. J Client five. Number 17 in the world. Jube 422. Dropping in. Machete Man. Ranked number 36 in the world. Dropping. Chaos has broken loose here. Alden, in consistent fashion, just waiting to burn up. He's going to finish. Under Thursday, nice. Bauer wants 30,000 points. Bauer, alas, you only get 54. Oh, sorry, your season score is not looking too hot there. Our Grand Prix, look at that, no change, unless someone gets 6,000 points. Which is not impossible. Listen, we've had some crazy points here before. That, ow. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool. Jen Asco just has to make sure she stays in here so nothing else happens. I feel like we slapped by those things. Exclamation point play. White Thunder, get in here. Was it a Overwatch Thunder? I did not get to, I apologize, I missed. Something went boom. Something go boom. It's going to get weird. There it is. Look at her. There she is. Everybody take notes. Her number 10 marble in the world. An infuriatingly base skin. Look at your DLC privilege here, people. Nice. You did four. Excellent. Jen Nasco, number 10 in the world. Marvel's community shook right now. Oh, Thunder. There's There are absolutely world rankings. And you see what happens when we get it there. Jen Nasco, earlier a few races ago, broke marbles. She set a world record on a highly played course. Got 32,000 points. Everybody who finished got like 20,000 points. Propelled them all into the top 100 rankings. Jay Klein has been sweating and muscling and trialing, and he's at he's at the 684 spot there. But everybody jumps over him today as Jen Nasco's points jack the entire thing up. That was how big of a fit. We didn't even get to see her finish. She just jumped past everybody. She got some kind of a great bounce that put her at the finish line. Blew the world record time out. And guess what? Get me up there to her again. She's on the move again. 
I want to be back here. We're back in forward. There we go. We're traveling in the correct direction. Oh, no! Oh! All right, I'll take it, Caster. Accusation for that one. Or J. Clyde bumped her off. Again, frustrated and upset. That here he is grinding marbles. And there goes Jen Nasco. Just snagging number 10 in the world. The Shetty Man did not make it there. C3 Marble taking over. Not that it matters, because Lord knows I'm not catching that score today. Hey, can somebody ban Thunder for saying this is random? No, no, no. Not random. All skill. It was a pure skill move by a Gen Nasco there. The fact that you say otherwise is, is insulting to the entire Marvels community. As I lock up first place, not a record time though, so oh well. Frankie Witch clears the debris field, drops in. Smeagol stuck behind some debris there. Jay Klein sneaks around. Circles the drain, gets in there first. White Thunder in. Oh, no, Dennis misses, and Dennis has to restart the entire... Oh, no, okay. I, I thought he made it. I thought he dropped off there. I give, give Dennis the finish. Alden possibly in danger. There we go. Alden's marble finishes. A few seconds off there. Oh, look at the... 33 points. How fitting. So, again, to point out here, there's her score, Thunder. We're just here for the XP. Jube, yeah, you're, you're, you are ranked. Jube, you are number 17 in the whole world. Machete Man, number 36. Funk, number 63. You all can thank Jen for putting you in the top rankings in the entire world. Exclamation point play. We're playing with a bunch of elites. We're playing with a bunch of sweaty tryhards now. The camera just blew up. Are there explosives on this one? Throbies, irrational, passing parade. Exclamation point play. Get your marbles on the track. Let me try this. Uh, set. 40k points. There we go. I'm going to have to try and find that video later to edit it so I can get my, uh, blowing my nose, I think, in the middle of Janasco's world record time out of it. So that's going to have to be edited since I don't think I effectively muted. Awesome. Just awesome. Here we go. Three seconds, two seconds, one second, and drop. Number 10, Marble in the World, Jen Asko. Still behind, Darkwing Dad and Darth Smeagol. On the move down here. What a day. We got a little funnel action here. And everybody just swirling around. A lot of course here to get done in that period of time. And finally, marbles are heading in. Clearing the path as Alden is followed by Darkwing, Darth Smeagol. Oh, the Channel 3 marble. Oh, my goodness, I don't, I can't even tell what's happening here. Is Darth Smeagol dropping way down? Oh my gosh. I, I have a feeling this is just like a, a death zone. Yep, Channel 3 Marble is just, just here to die. I think everybody who's here is just a matter of uh, waiting to die. So congratulations. You're all in an explosive minefield waiting to get away. Alden on the move. Stuck here in the middle. Jay Klein taking over. Trying to grind away. Getting a better range. So we are again nearly costing him ranking points today. GTP down. We're down to eight marbles remaining. Number 10 player in the world is currently in fifth place. Talk about breaking the curve. Oh my goodness. 
Oh, it's White Thunder, though. The path White Thunder took. Mr. Oh, is this, this game random? Had a very skillful decision there. To bypass whatever else was going on here. And as such, everyone is trying to catch up to White Thunder now. Our oh, second place in trivia today. Nicely done. Never easy. Thunder just trying to, to stay alive here. Some favorable bounces for White Thunder. And just the formality of him finishing first. Again, barring somebody getting some kind of weird explosive jump. Oh my oh god, I thought that was gonna fall. White Thunder's in. Doesn't matter what happens to his marble now. Oh my goodness, second place is all the way back here. Machete Man. Trying to get past Darth Smeagol here. Smeagol and Machete Man both clearing. Into the fields they go. Machete Man taking over here. We'll lock up second place. Followed by Darth Smeagol for third. Exploding for celebration here. And it looks like the rest of these marbles are going to burn up because Cranky Witch is coming in. Fifth in the world. And tenth in the world. Fifth in this race. Coming in just ahead of number 684. Alden, again, burning up, re-entering the atmosphere. Here it comes. Just behind Buster Boy. White Thunder with a win here. I uh, got 72 points, not 32,000, so we have no movement in our Grand Prix from today. Machete Man was in the minefield. That's right. And managed to get second place. Must have blown his marble up into a correct, correct spot. Exclamation point play. Thirty-two thousand points. I'm still dying. That's great. Oh, Jen Nasco. It's not the camera getting blown up. It's the top ten player in the world being announced in the entrance. That's what's happening every time. It's not an. Ex I thought there's like a random barrel exploding. No, it's Jen Nasco's presence being announced by the Marbles community. Letting you know greatness is among us. 20 seconds left to get your marble on the track. Exclamation point play. Darth Smeagol getting his marble in there. It, yeah, it, it is. It, it's not even a show off she's trying to do. She's got this number 10 rank flex there. Yes, 022, 2 o'clock. So I, I put it in late. I forgot to put it in, but it is in there. I posted both on daytime and fall guys. Everybody's going to have hugs to dish out after whatever happened here today. We will not forget this day that Jen Nasco broke marbles on the stream. Dennis trailing behind channel three and 022. Wild turns being taken here. Ooh, everybody just jammed up on one another. White Thunder pulling ahead. Wants to go back to back here. Let's see if that will get him 32,000 points. But alas, it does not. Oh, boy. Oh, was that... Who got launched there? Buster? Oh, no. There goes Buster. Into the endless void. Goes Buster. Launched into the atmosphere. Pour one out for Buster. Channel 3, Marble, Dennis, and Bauer all just kind of neck and neck here, just a little chippy with one another. Channel 3 and Bauer bypassing the outside, the, uh, the center part here. Oh my goodness, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Okay, let's go. C3, Marble, Dennis, gone. This falls off there. Number 10 player in the world trailing behind me right now. 022 and Bauer. Both got a little too greedy. GTP, Machete Man, everybody just driving off the track up there. That debris not favorable behind me here. Jen Nasco picking up speed. Let's see here. She might, she might come and bypass this. Uh, she's going to skip that altogether. C3 Marble on the move, going around here. 
number 10 player in the world still chasing me down. I'm terrified. <laughs> yeah, you, uh, I, I believe you should, uh, O22, if you're going to refer to Machete Man, refer to them as top 100 player in the world. They should correctly be identified as number 63 player in the world, Funk. Everybody making fun of Funk for never finishing, but Funk, number 63 in the world. Number 10 player in the world coming in fourth. Smeagol, Cranky Witch. All the unranked coming in. And then finally, number 17 in the world, Jube. <laughs> coming in. I got 60 points, so I'm chipping away. Oh, now it's... 32,230. So, never mind. Didn't really chip much away there at that first place score. You caught that scoreboard yet, 022? Or is this your first glance at it? It's a pretty one today. Exclamation point play. Pepper Live, welcome in. Welcome to our broken game of marbles. Jen Nasco's explosive entrance here again. Number 10 player in the world. All because of one race where she jumped over everybody. Exploding onto the scene now. Pepper, I will let you know you're welcome to play with us. Feel free to hang out. We do we do this as part of a daily event for uh, Channel3.gg. Lovely little social media site. Gamify. We get extra XP for this. We have extra events for it. You want to know something funny? It's going to happen today. Oh my God, guys, guys, guys. Do you know who first eliminated was today on Alienated? Do you know who first eliminated was? We're going to have it. I've been waiting for it to happen. Jen Nasco will get both first eliminated and barring some kind of either miracle and or disaster. She will get the win and she will get first eliminated. We are witnessing a legendary day here. I am all smiles knowing this has occurred. I said it the other day, it's going to happen someday. And we bear witness to it today. Where's laugh at Brian? I want Brian to come in. Tell him the, tell him the Grand Prix is still wide open. He's got to get a marble in here and then have him see the scoreboard. I don't think I was here is a good enough tagline. I'm, te I'm tempted to do something. I'm really, I'm really picturing the uh, the war boys in uh, Fury Road, just yelling, "Witness me!" She's going to have first eliminated, barring disaster in these last six races. She's going to have the win. What am I doing, Alden? Alden's up there. Get me up to Alden. I, I missed where Alden took over there. Alden, let's follow. Let's follow Alden closely here. As he makes his way through the solar system, Machete Man. A reminder for everybody. Anyway, the event code is there. Make sure you've RSVP'd. Make my life easier, especially if you've got a weird. Compared to your Twitch name. Bear witness to Jen Nasco. GTP, for all the times you're dropping her, her actual name on here, letting her know how, how the business is going to be, the fact that she is so decisively taking care of this today is impressive. Let's back up here. Just enjoyed, enjoyed following Alden a little closely on that one. Where's the uh, ghost marble? Oh, ghost marbles. Way up here, the funk marble. Nobody catching, nobody catching the funk marble today. I don't know how that happened. How does ghost marble get all the way up there? It's already 227. Oh, wow. Something got, something's really slow on this one today. What did Smeagol drop here? The quest for the uh, world record time? Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, I just need to get a better. I, I, I need to edit that clip so it's not me going <clears throat> and blowing my nose into the middle of it, which I'm pretty sure I did by accident. Oh, uh, O2 2, we haven't reached the death zone yet. I mean, I know some people die at that uh, Jupiter Saturn jump. It's up ahead here where the pins just pop in. That's that's where it really gets you. This current season record on this course is terrible. Funk was, I remember his 257 before. Because Funk was only five seconds off of it. Not even, it was like four and a half seconds off. Oh, I don't like Golden's placement for this pin here. Oh, dodges it. Not going to dodge the next one, though, if it pops up. Golden hanging in there. I feel like this, this course has gotten slower or something. Funk just ruined everything. Oh, 0 oh, 2 2, there's your, there's your death. Number 10 player in the world did not make it through this one. Frankie Witch, we're, we're losing all the Nascos here. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Alden, hold on. Hold on. There we go. Okay. Should go around to that pin nicely. Alden taking the win here. Jube bumped off. Cody B gets the job done. GTP, at least one NASCAR is able to finish, followed by Bauer. Pepper live. Hitting the pin, giving Smeagol a shot. Nope, Smeagol can't catch up here. We've got our last two marbles coming in, which will be Dennis and one white thunder. 022, new death was coming for him. And uh, as we check our notes here, no one has caught up to Jen's 32,000 points. Unlock the computer to see Jen Esco's message. Now here's one we can set a world record. Twilight Westy. That was yesterday. She was only 10 seconds off. Riding the lightning here. Riding the explosions. Which is not easy because you have to ride the explosions. Then hit the brakes as Jen Asko, speaking of explosions, makes her number 10 in the world presence known. The Twilight Westy. One of multiple kids home for sick days playing marbles yesterday. Smoked her dad's record. Took it out of his hands. He had a 54 second time before that. Took the local record for Channel 3, but it was really only less than 10 seconds off. Seven and change seconds off from the world record. So, not impossible here. Less than 10 seconds to go. Exclamation point play. And away we go. As the marbles drop down, and let's see who we can follow. Jen Nasca will get that number one in the world tagline, though. And if I could figure out a, a more fun way to list the fact that we all bore witness to that, I will do so. Oh my gosh. That barrel whacked three people. Darkwing Dad on the move in the right direction. But alas, here we go. Two seconds on the world record time is blown. And Darkwing doesn't matter. It's dead anyway. Oh, Dennis dodges the barrel. Jube taking over here. Oh, nope, never mind. Jube going the wrong way. Dennis just going side to side. Oh, trying to avoid the barrels here. Doesn't avoid that one going the wrong way. Pepper. Pepper well, was taking over briefly. Number 10 player in the world, Jen Asko. There she goes. She's on the move. Let's go. She might get 100 points out of this. That's really going to make a big difference here. Bouncing side to side. Dodging. Oh, wrong way. Giving Machete Man possible opportunity to take over here. Let's see where Machete's moving. Machete's moving in the correct direction. Nasco's still, still kind of there. Oh, Jen Nasco definitely bouncing the wrong way now. Machete Man now firmly in first place. Got some exploding barrels up ahead, though. There it goes, Machete. Going the wrong way. I hope this is not a day where Marbles on stream wins this race. Let 
Listen, Marbula won or not, Bauer. I gotta tell you, tell tell Knight. He needs he needs to get Jen Nasco on the team after that performance. Oh, GTP almost almost making it through there. It's like machete man way back. GTP now moving in the right direction. Dodges that barrel there. Oh no. Buster Boy moving through. Let's see here. GTP kind of crawling along. I think it's five minutes this one cuts off at, so we still got time. Oh no, GTP probably too much juice. No, he makes it. GTP has officially started the countdown clock for the death of everyone else back here. Let's head to the back right now. Oh, of course my mom is back there. Jude. Oh god, I'm way back there. Buster Boy is at the end, barring a weird explosion. Got second place here. Everybody else coming in as well. We didn't have a full curve breaking. Oh no, Pepper at the end. Oh, sorry, Pepper. Oh, Knight. Knight, uh, wait till you take a look at our scoreboard here for this Grand Prix. That's all I'm going to say. Get your, get, just just register so you can get your participation XP now because you're not catching. You're not catching this one. We got we got some we got some new. Take a look at this. We got some chunkies, all right. Jen Asko's taking over the number ten spot in the world, following a crazy world record time, taking Jube to seventeen, Machete to seven uh, thirty-seven, and Funk to sixty-three. I assume Jay Klein is again run off to another marbles course. Yeah, it was a it was a crazy record. It was like a 181 race course. It was it was big. Nightcrawler is here. At his fancy official marble. But not the number 10 in the world entrance marble that Jen Asko has. Just over 30 seconds for everybody to uh, to get in here. Yep, Smeagol, the curve, the curve is broken today. Exclamation point play. Darkwing Dad, you are in right there, good. Ennis, you're in. That's got a good placement to the uh, starting line there. Picked all high-ranking courses. Yeah, no, Grumpy. I will, I will pull that clip and edit it because, again, I'm pretty sure I blew my nose like after she finished beforehand. So I'll tighten that one up. <laughs> we don't need that clip existing anywhere else. Or nose. We'll probably hear a honking noise of me trying to blow my nose. I love this weather change. I feel like there's a little spite on the my daughter's clip because Lord knows it was not your clip there. There was a little record. I noticed you haven't dropped her full name in the chat today, scolding her. You 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 uh, really got put in your place here. Yeah, I, I have to go back and see what happened because we had lost her even, and suddenly she was just approaching the finish line. Like something happened that she got just one of those great bounces. Way she went. Get me down to Funk. Get me down with Funk. Let's go. There we go. Funk on the move being trailed by Darkwing Dad. A, a, a crazy finish. Oh, Funk getting stuck in there. Darkwing and 022 clearing ahead as Funk gets slapped around and stuck. Pepper. Pepper live, following behind now. See if Darkwing can stay. Oh no, Darkwing is going to get buried in the middle here. Pepper, what happened to Pepper Live and 022? They were both right there. Ah, Smeagol's channel three marble. Everybody's just going away. 
What? What was that? Mickey Witch gone. Darkwing dead. Taking the spot here. It's White Thunder and Machete Man. Jenasco gone for this one. So you got a chance to chip away to 32,230 or whatever it was. But alas, no world record time on this one. GTP trying to stay in ahead here. Light and Jube coming in. As long as they ride the wall, they should be fine. Because the, Oh no, Jube. Jube moving in the wrong direction, trying to be the ninth marble to finish. There we go. Jube should be just fine now. Knight finishing in eight, and Jube finishing number nine. Darkwing Dad gets up to 103 points. Darth Smeagol with a 206. That would be respectable any other day that wasn't today. GTP at 216. Jen Nasco is 32,230 with three races left. Get ready, everybody, to drop your exclamation point play now. Dazzling Master's Dream. That was Jen arriving. You know that. You know that noise now. Exclamation point play. Pepper Live, as I mentioned, mostly everybody else here already on Channel 3. I don't know if you are or not. I apologize. But if you'd like to uh, get some extra XP for today, we play all sorts of games. You can get experience points for posting all sorts of stuff. In the case of Jen Asker today, she'll get a whole level up bonus and uh, ultimately be recognized for having a number one world record. Dennis dropping his referral for that little extra XP. No doubt Smeagol dropped it earlier wasn't paying that much attention but there's an event code there because what will happen afterwards i will send all of our participants for today some experience points who have rsvp'd thank you for playing jen will get a little bit of a bonus as our winner and also coincidentally we usually give our first eliminated player some extra xp as well which uh was also checking notes jen nasco she's going to suck every extra experience point up from today's races MC Logic, he's here for the XP. But he's also here trying to take first place. Pepper Light, what? Pepper, is your marble defective? Are you using one of those DLC privilege marbles and, and you picked a bad one? So we have lost Pepper Live again. Jube has taken over. Look at, the, look at this three top hundo ranked marbles here, followed by Knight. Some elitist marbles up here. Oh, there goes Knight. Knight was trying to hang with those top 10, mar those top 100 marbles and got slapped for it. GTP is going to finish ahead. Oh no, maybe not. There's a, there's a little drop here at the end. Jube and Funk followed by O2, GTP then 022. Alden, Genasco, Cranky Witch, Bauer. Shetty Man, Buster Boy are coming in here. We lost two marbles along the way. One of which was Pepper Live. Pepper Live is going to riot. Filing complaints to the league offices. Ian, thanks for hanging out. Glad school is over. Congratulations. Enjoy the move away from college. Darkwing Dad. Not going to finish this one, I think. Not the right momentum. The flames are coming for him, unless he gets a really good drop here. Swinging back and forth. Yep, that's going to be the end of Darkwing Dead. Almost getting it there. No, Darkwing Dead does manage to finish. Nice. This was a 19 second record time on this one. Jube. Adding 38 points to his 26,451. Still not making a dent on the 32,230. Darkwing Dad just wanted some flair here. All right, so I think that's two races left in this particular Grand Prix. 
Exclamation point play. Ian, Jen, Jen Asco. No, no, Jen Asco set a big world record on a highly raced course. She jacked up everything. As you can see here, Ian, we not only have Jen Nasco who bumped up to number 10 in the world. Along the way, she took Machete Man up to 37 and uh, Funk to number 64. She got a 32,000 point boost because of, it was like a, a near 200 play, near 200 race course that she, uh, she had there. A huge record. And we just waited because we knew that 32,000 points was going to knock them all into the top 100. Jay Klein went to go play some other marbles tables, I think, because he he was at 673 and dropped progressively, partially because of the racers who got to ride Jen's coattails there. We'll get the clip posted later. I have to go pull it down and edit it. You edit out me blowing my nose in the middle of it. I covered my camera up, but I didn't mute. Butthead. Buster Boy leading the climb back up. O two 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 taking shots. Is Machete Man your brother or just somebody you race with? I can't remember. Machete Man. I'm sorry. I don't know if Machete Man has to talk to somebody who's not in the top 100 rankings anymore. O two two. He may literally be too good to talk to you. I'm not kidding. I don't know. He may not even see your messages at this point. Darth Smeagol frustrated at a solid 206 point performance. That won't matter for anything because it's not 32,000 point performance. Knight busted. Clocked by the pins down there. Dennis somehow jumps up there. Oh, Dennis Portally. Jen Nasco Portally. Nasco not content. O two two portal. What? What is happening here? This is a wild course. O two two might be stuck in wall purgatory though. Manages to get to the outside track. O two two now on the climb through the walls here. So we have three. Oh, that's right. Because I was going for high play courses, figuring they were pretty good quality. And then Alden had a suggestion for something, and I can't remember. I think oh, he's trying to get nuclear. And somehow the only thing we could get to was fire. O two two into the grinder, trying to get a record time here, but this is only a three race course. O two two will in fact set a record here. It's only a, it's only a three racer, so not that impressive, but might be enough to, to get a little bit of points this year. Jen Nasco will ride those points though, because she's getting second place anyway. What is it we're? Uh... Someone says, like, quiet three, two sevens are talking or something like that. That's basically what Machete Man's doing to O2-2 now. Grumpy trash player. Just proud. Proud of the daughter. The, the marble racing daughter he's raised. Just getting in here. O2-2. It's only, it's only a three-play course, though, O2-2. It's only a three-play course. O2-2 gets 86 points out of that. That's how crazy Jen Nasco's race was. She gets 70 points out of it anyway. Let's let's put a bow on this. Uh, machete man it for your friend. Okay, okay. Exclamation point play. Let's, let's put an end to this. Now, now here's what we're going to do though. Yeah, that's it. We're gonna we're gonna call this here. We got some fall guys after. We'll, we'll be back at 2 o'clock. We'll take a little break. So, 022, yeah, the, the, it was the courses, the difficulty, the amount that they blew it out. Again, the clip will be the clip will be posted later. Exclamation point play. My final reminder to everybody. RSVPM. We'll be playing Fall Guys at 2 o'clock, so in about 45 minutes. The dog will get her pampering. 
she will get her play time we're settled make sure I have all the stickers shipped off that I have everybody who requested Away we go. We're going to watch from a distance for this one. We do this one just to kind of finish off. It's not my favorite course, but it has kind of just become a bit. <sighs> yeah, I, I, I downloaded Stumble, guys. I'm not kidding. Just to see. See if Stumble guys in. Because, uh, yeah, they. they all guys, they, they messed up. They, they, AA run, they done messed up. Holding going out with a splash. Splish splash. Watch our blues as Bauer and Funk are coming around the blue track here. Pay no attention to that purple slide that just slows you down at the end. We got some greenies though. Very curious here is Machete Man. Yeah. On the move, Machete Man's going to, to lock this one up here. Followed by Nightcrawler. White Thunder coming along, but we'll be behind Cranky Witch. Cranky Witch had some nice momentum going into that one. Dennis followed by the number 10 player in the world. Everybody else coming along here. Should be enough time for all to finish. Machete Man. Two seconds off of the, of the uh, world record here. Four seconds off of the basis time. That's just for the season. Is uh, the wreck time. Let, let's let's call this one a finish here. So Mesa's, So it's a new season world record. So that's why Mace's time is ahead of that. Machete Man, world ranked. Jube, world ranked. And the number 10 in the world, Jen Nasco. 32,300 points. Let me just scroll down the points here. That way I can make sure everybody gets their RSVPing. Done. We'll send out points here. Now, what we're going to do though, we're going to take a quick peek here before. And look at this. Look at this, sports fans. Crazy where number one is at. Jen Nasco. Number 10 in the world. Last win at Channel 3 GG. That's what we're talking about, people. Last win here. Oh, good Lord. What's happening here? So here's what we're going to do. Let me see. Jube is number 16. Yeah, oh yeah, we've got we've got a few here. Jube's at 17. Uh, got some others like Machete Man's somewhere. There's Machete Man at 37. We get down to the 60s. I would say there's Funk at 64. Just just crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Stretch of time here. So let's see who. We can all go brag and let the other NASCO know records happen over here. So we'll send you over to what is this the other uh, NASCO? Anyway, we'll be back. Have a good one. 